Hello everyone, my name is JerryBR and welcome back to Digimon Survive. So we need to go check in on everyone. Huh, Shuiji and Lopmon are heading out alone somewhere. I wonder where they're going. Let's follow them, Takuma. Right. Wow, that school is run down. There they are. Looks like they didn't go too far. Hey Shuji, what's going on? Huh? Oh, Takuma, I feel like I should ask you that. You seem concerned about something. Me? No, I was just wondering something worried something was ha wrong when I saw you head into the woods. What? Oh, us wandering off on our own must have made you concerned. It wasn't Shuji's fault. I heard something weird and he came with me to investigate. Sorry to make you worry. I didn't realize how far we'd gone. But you'll probably tell me I shouldn't be going off on my own in the first place. Oh, uh, well. Shuji noticed something odd and followed up right away. It's good that he was decisive. He was right. Acting independently without telling anyone could lead to trouble. Thanks, Shuji. Sure. There's no need to apologize. You went to see if there was something dangerous out there. If anything, I feel like I should be thanking you, so thanks, Shuji. You mean it? I, I don't know what to say when you come out and thank me like that. <clears throat> Still, I shouldn't have acted alone. That I regret. I'll tell someone next time. Wow, Shuji, that was so level-headed. Haha, <laughs> which is to say, my actions up until now haven't been very well thought out. Yes, I still have a ways to go. So that weird sound was coming from around here. Oh yeah, seemed like there was a lot of rustling in the grass, so I was worried. We're still not sure if it's an enemy or not, so I won't go too far. Don't worry. I'll just check it out and come back. Plus, with Lotmon to protect me, I'll be fine. Eee, <laughs> that's right, Shuji. Well, in that case, I'll leave this to you two. Just don't do anything crazy, okay? We won't. Don't worry. I mean, if they go and do something crazy, I'll be shocked. If we didn't turn up anything, maybe Lotmon was just imagining things. Maybe you guys found the sovereign monster. Alright, so what's in the corridor? Ah, just junk. Come on. Two clean dressings. I thought one of them would be that a memory. Hey, Takuma, which way is the amusement park from here? Uh, over that way? Great, thanks, Takuma. Is she gonna, like, shout out? Hmm, looks like she's praying in the direction of the amusement park. Please let everyone be okay. Oh, were you praying for the safety of the little ones in the amusement park? Yeah, I know we can't go see them again until we beat the master, but I'm still worried. That's real nice of you, Mio. Well, of course she'd be worried about them. She was their queen. <laughs> but now all I can do is pray that they're safe. What do you think, Takuma? Are Jijima and the little ones all okay? I'm not sure how to answer that. I want to cheer up, but I don't want to lie. I mean, yeah, probably. Let's trust in them and have faith that they're all okay. Have faith? That's right, we can't know how they're doing for sure. But we did all we could for them. Now we just have to trust that they'll make it on their own. Oh, I get it. I'm sure they can make it if they try. I'm going to have faith in them. You know, while we're still in this world, we can go back to the park and see everyone. But after we go back home, we'll never be able to see them again. Maybe not, but I wouldn't give up hope. The professor was able to come back as an adult, so it's not like we can never return. Oh yeah, you're right. We might be able to come back. Thanks, Takuma. Now I'm not worried about anything anymore. I may have said that to encourage Mio. I realized I'd had the same odd certainty. It's feeling that if we ever go back to our world, we'll never come here again. I can't believe that didn't earn me any points with Mio. I thought I handled that well. Is there anything outside? Something at the shrine? Nope. Alright. Rio! What up? Did 
Did you see this thing here? Did you see this ointment? It's funny, I feel like whenever we're he here, this is where you spend all your time, Ryo. Well, it's not like I got go to other places too, you know. Oh, I misread that. Oh yeah, I'm sure you do. You probably just think that because of how I shut myself in here when I was freaked out. Or, yeah, sorry, that's probably it. Psh, you don't gotta apologize. Looking back on it now, it was pretty pathetic. It started with me being scared of Kunamon. Then we met Haru, or I guess Renamon. I was convinced he was a ghost. Top it all off, Dokugumon showed up. I just totally lost it. My head was a mess. I felt like I couldn't think anymore. But now he can say all that with a smile. Ryo isn't the nervous wreck he was before. Though he does seem jumpy even now. Maybe he hasn't changed that much. Uh, I guess just do the compliment. He really changed. All that's in the past now. Yeah, well, you know. Constant brushes with death will do that to you, whether you like it or not. The way you are now, I bet you'd be fine even if a ghost really did show up. I wouldn't go that far, even though I thought there really was a ghost. I was terrified. I think if one showed up now, I'd still be afraid. There aren't any ghosts around here, are there? No, I'm pretty sure there aren't. But I have no way to know that. Yeah, that's right. Phew. That was the conversation we needed. <sighs> oh, that's... You tired, Takuma? Oh no. I was just thinking about how we're coming up on the end of all this. We just need to find the last shrine, take on the master, save Mayuki, and then... And then you'll go home. Oh, come on. Hey, it's okay. I'm sure it won't be the last time we see each other. Right. Anyway, let's not think too far ahead. <laughs> what was that scream? It came from that classroom over there. Right, let's go, Agumon. Sounded like Ryo, I think. Oh no, Kunmon's afraid too. Ryo, are you okay? What happened? <laughs> it was real! This time it was real! What was real? What did you see? A, a ghost! It was a real ghost! A ghost? Ryo! Is it you who screamed just now? What happened? Uh, Ryo says he saw a ghost. Seriously? A ghost? Dude, you know you pulled that one before, right? It's not funny this time either. It was real. This wasn't like that time with Haru. I could see through it and everything. I mean, we were just talking about this. Maybe that's got ghosts on your mind? Yeah, man. I'm, pretty, I'm sure it's fine. That was just your mind playing tricks with you. I gotta say, though, still believe in ghosts at your age? What an innocent soul. Who says I b believe in ghosts? I'm not even scared. Dude, I can see your legs shaking. Th that's just because it's cold. Both of you relax. Let us simply be glad that everyone is okay. Right, and we should probably stay on the alert. Call everyone if you notice anything. Sure thing. <laughs> oh, alright. Seriously, though, what was that thing? Come on, I just want one of these damn memories. Even though if I get one... Even though if I find one, I'm probably not going to find the other three. Alright, um, old school.
Kaito, what are you doing? You know how we didn't fight much today? I thought I'd make up for that by training. And he's got me going along with it. Talk about a pain in the neck. Hey, quit complaining and let's go again. Can't get into this if I'm not facing you. Oh, alright. I guess I can't say no when you put it like that. We're coming up on the end of this. You know, we gotta be ready. Kaito. You might not think it to look at him or to hear him talk, but Kaito's a good guy. And he's got a point. Maybe I should join him. Oh, but I'd hate to get in his way. You know, that's a good point. You mind if I join you? Sure, no problem. Training with you ought to be a good workout. Haha. <laughs> Go easy on me, okay? I'm gonna train too! We can make it a team match then. You ready for this, Drakmon? You bet I am. Let's show them what real teamwork looks like. Wait, are they teaming up? Are they teaming up to fight us? Or... Whew, that was a real workout. I'll head back after I take a quick break. You go on ahead. Is that Renamon? I wonder if this place calms her down. Probably. Oh, here you are, Renamon. Yes, hello, Takama. I thought if there was anything in this place that felt like it was mine, this was it. You know, I never thought we'd all come back here again. So this place means something to you? You could say that. Whatever else is true, this is where I have the strongest memories. It's the one place that I brought Miyayuki joy. Back when she could, wouldn't respond to anything. She would sing and I would play along. She'd even play piano a little, if badly. Her expression stayed as blank as ever. It was the closest she came to being herself. Those two must have been... Those must have been good times for Renamon too. It would have been nice to see Mayuki enjoying herself. I wish they'd let us play too. You liked it too, huh? What makes you say that? Didn't you know this whole time you've had the nicest smile on your face? Oh, I have, huh? Well, it was nice. Those are some of my fondest memories that I hope I never forget. There's that smile again. Mayuki really does mean a lot to him, doesn't she? Back when I first met Mayuki, she was a lot more impressive than she was here. If we defeat the Master, I wonder if she'll go back to being like that. <sighs> what do you think, Takuma? Will I ever hear my sister sing again? Don't worry, Haru. We're all doing everything we can to make that happen. Thank you, Takuma. I too will do everything in my power to save Mayuki. Alright. One more person to chat. And then maybe, I don't know, something will change. But who knows what. I wonder if she'll see a ghost. Aha. Oh, it's a pineapple. There, all set. Now I just need to wait for Aoi. <laughs> You're in a good mood, Saki. Why wouldn't I be? It's been forever since the last time I cooked with Aoi. I'm psyched. Oh, hey Saki, where's Aoi? Hi Takuma, if it's Aoi you're after, she went to the gym to check on the ingredients. Oh, okay, so you've been getting things ready here in the meantime? You got it. Just got everything all set, so we can start cooking anytime. You've really gotten better at this, huh? At first, Aoi had to teach you everything. Yeah, well, so what? Everyone's like that when they're just getting started. But now, you and Aoi work together. Perfectly. You've really come a long way. <laughs> yeah, well, you know, when Aoi and I work together, we're unstoppable. For sure, anyone can see what a team... Nice team you two make. You get along great now. 
Aoi and Saki's relationship. The way they understand each other, and it feels so familiar. Mother and daughter. Best friends, sisters, best friends, sisters. Uh, what's, it's not mother and daughter. I think that's weird. Sisters? Sisters are closer than best friends, right? Sometimes it feels like you two are sisters. What? You mean Aoi and me? Yeah, it comes through in how you get along and know what the other's thinking. You really think so? Aoi and me as sisters? <laughs> Wouldn't that be nice? She's actually squirming and with a smile on her face. Never seen her so happy. <laughs> you think if I called Aoi sis, she'd be surprised? Oh, that sounds like fun. I want to do that too. Yeah, we're all totally sisters now. Well, one thing's for sure. Howie's in for a pretty big surprise. Hey, Saki. What are we having for dinner? That's a surprise. Oh. But it's going to be a real treat. You're going to want to come hungry. After all, this may be the last dinner we have here. Sure, so I'll be looking forward to this one. Yeah, you better. By the way, Saki, didn't you say you thought someone was at the table earlier? Oh yeah, but there's nobody there now, is there? Did you pass anyone on your way here, Takuma? Uh, no, I don't think so. I guess I must have imagined it. Now is someone else going to see it? Where should we go next? I bet someone else sees a ghost next. I'm not sure. We don't really have anything to do, so we could go back to the classroom. I guess it could be one of those blue soldier ghosts. Takuma, are you still nearby? That was Saki. It sounded like she was upset. Something must have happened. Let's go, Agumon. I can't believe they never moved that board out of the way. They've lived here for weeks. Saki, what happened? Uh, Takuma, am I glad to see you? What's wrong? You look pale. Well, after you left, I couldn't shake this feeling. Someone else was there. You know, Ryo did freak out in the classroom earlier. He said he saw a ghost. He, he, he did? Oh, I don't like this one bit, Takuma. I'm scared. Can you stay until Aoi gets back? I guess Saki is afraid of ghosts. That's a little surprising, but also kind of cute. I'm not sensing anyone besides us in the school right now. Yeah, I don't sense any enemies either. So you don't think there's an enemy like Dokugumon that snuck in while we were away? If there was, we'd at least be able to sense it. But no, we're the only ones here. Huh. Saki, I need to go warn the others about this. You stay here with Florimon. Uh, okay. If you say so. Don't worry, Saki. Whatever's out there, I'll protect you. Right, I'm seriously counting on you, Florimon. Well, so much for taking it easy. I hope this all just... It's just people's imagining things. Did we? I don't remember where I left off last time. I can only assume I need to talk to Aoi. Finish going over my part of the ingredients, Aoi. Thanks. I should be done with mine soon, too. So hold on just a minute. Checking on our ingredients, Aoi? Oh, hi, Takuma. Yes, I've been thinking of what to make with what we still have stored. There's not much left. Since this will be all, all be over soon, I want to make a feast. Sounds good to me. Need any help with anything? No, I'm just about done here, and Saki will be helping me cook, so I'm all set. Oh yeah, Saki. What is it, Takuma? Something wrong? Well, you see, there was a ghost. A ghost? Yeah, apparently both Ryo and Saki have seen it. It left them both pretty scared. Oh, okay, a ghost. Yes, I can I can see why Saki would be scared. Sounds like Aoi's pretty scared, too. 
I was hoping she could stay and look after Saki, but maybe Aoi needs help herself. Reminder, she has Labramon. Hey, I wouldn't worry about any ghosts if I were you. I'm sure Labramon will protect you. Yeah, you can count on me, Aoi. Yes, yes, you're right. I'm sure everything will be fine as long as Labramon's with me. But, oh, I don't know what I'd do if I actually saw a ghost. Hmm, I guess that wasn't as encouraging as I'd hoped. Anyway, better get back to Saki as soon as I can. Well, guess what? I can this we're gonna tell her there's no such thing as ghost and if there were I'll have to come and bust it it's not real hey don't worry it's not like there's really a ghost you don't have to be scared yes you're right there's no such thing as ghosts there couldn't really be but wait is that true Labramon and the others are real. Maybe there are ghosts, too. Oops, I forgot how smart Aoi is. Guess I should have tried to fool her. Anyway, I better get back to Saki as soon as I can. Yeah, take care, okay? Don't worry, I will. Huh. I thought that would have been it. Professor! There's a ghost! What do you know about ghosts? Are you a ghost professor? Oh, Professor, I didn't expect to find you here. Yes, well, it's far too dangerous to be investigating any of the shrines right now. So Gabumon and I have been going over everything we've learned so far. Akiharu's learned some real complicated stuff now that he's bigger. I can't keep up. Haha, <laughs> I'm sorry if it's hard to follow, but talking to you helps me organize my thoughts. Speaking of which, perhaps you could ask me some questions. Who, me? Yes, sometimes it's useful to consider questions from another perspective. Don't be intimidated. Feel free to ask about anything you'd like to know. I do have a bunch of new questions since we found the Sovereign Monster Shrines. Bye! Let's see. Okay, yeah. Just want to make sure that was... Uh, what do you think about the Kamanagami? What does it mean that the humans and Kamanagami are two halves of the same soul? I'm still puzzled that one, out that one myself. It is, after all, a truth to be felt, not reasoned. What do you mean? Have you not felt it in your tie to Agumon? How your thoughts and feelings are one? Oh yeah, I have, especially when Agumon evolves. Yes, it was the same with me. I felt it very strongly when Gabumon evolved. And as our Kamanogami have said, aren't you more at peace when you're with your partner? I certainly do, only it's impossible to quantify. Most people would understand, even if we explained it to them. Only those with their own Kamanogami partner would. If we want everyone to know what that's like, we'd need to connect this world and ours. Um, Professor? Oh, my apologies. I'm afraid I got caught up. Connecting both worlds was Piedmon's goal. We probably shouldn't be trying to do it. Uh, yes. I have more questions. What do you think about this world? What, so what did you mean when you said this world is made of people's thoughts? Well, though you may find it hard to believe, I meant that quite literally. The school, the apartments, even that theme park were made from my sister's memories. And the others told us that world was more chaotic when they arrived, in times of war. I believe this world operates on principles similar to myths, legends, and ghost stories. G ghost stories? Scary stories make people afraid of places. They avoid them. They become truly scary. Similarly, people gather in places considered holy or famous, which makes them special. I believe it's a m more extreme version of this principle, by which our world shapes this one. Huh. I feel like I kind of get it, but I also kind of don't. Yep, one last question. The master, Haru Chika. Who or what is he exactly? Ah, he was a companion of the human partners of the Sovereign Monsters. He betrayed them. Now brings ruin to this world. Apparently his sister turned on him, sending him here. It's a sacrifice. Being a younger brother myself, I can sympathize. But I have hope that his malice can be ended. I spent decades pursuing Mayuki. Sibling ties are strong. Professor, though no good researcher should make their own feelings the basis for their theories. No, I trust your feelings too. <laughs> you do? Eh? Well, I'm glad to hear it. Hmm. 
Thinking back on it all now, the one thing that bothers me is the Master's goal. He intends to use my sister to realize his final, deadly desire. You think he's willing to destroy both worlds to get what he wants? It's hard to say. We know so little, it could be anything. But my sister can bring the worlds together. If he uses that power, he could do anything. Yeah, but why hasn't he? I am, of course, concerned for my sister. But we also need to stop him to save both worlds. Right, we have to stop him no matter what. <laughs> well, you've helped me make a lot of progress. Thanks for talking to me, Takuma. Oh no. Thank you for answering all my questions. One more thing, though. We think there might be a ghost, so you should keep an eye out. A ghost? Yes, well, I suppose there could be one here, considering who we've met. Leave it to the professor to be mature about this. Uh, when he says who we've met, he means Gabumon and the others, right? I think that's the only ghost. This is going to be another ghost. Minoru's going to love it if it is. Hey, Takuma. Ryu is still freaking out about that ghost. Man, just when I was starting to think he'd grow a spine, I guess that's Ryo for you. Well, about that. Apparently Saki noticed some weird presence in the cafeteria, too. Let's see if this... How Minoru reacts. I'm assuming badly. What? Seriously? Still, I don't know. I don't see how it could be a ghost. We are coming up on the end of all this. Maybe she's just on edge. I get what Minoru is saying, and I agree. But, Ryo and Saki's reactions have me worried. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, maybe that's it. We are all pretty worn out. That's what I'm saying. There can't really be a ghost out there. It's not like we're in a comic book. Though some monsters like Fangmon and Arukenimon seem like they could be in one. That's different. Look, I'm sure we'll all feel better after we rest. Being on edge makes you see things. Right. Yeah, that's probably it. But even if it turns out to be nothing, it couldn't hurt to be on our guard, right? That's true. We're coming up on the finish line, so we should be careful we don't slip. Ah, but before that, I better get take a leak. See you around, Takuma. Uh, yeah. Watch out for the bathroom. It might be haunted. Man, if I gotta take a leak. Why is he... Is, this... is all this talk about a ghost really just because everyone's so worked up? I can see why Minoru would say that, but is that really what's going on here? We don't know what the Master or the Kenzoku are up to. Could this be a trick? Yeah, I'd better stay on my guard. <laughs> Was that Minoru? Takuma, this way. Right, let's go. The ghost doesn't follow the one rule. You can't attack somebody while they're in the bathroom. Man, man, oh man, oh man, oh man. Minoru, what happened? T Takuma, it was a g -g ghost, an actual ghost. So now even Minoru's seen it? Hey, what was all that screaming? Ryo, Minoru says he saw it too. Saw it? You mean, it was an actual ghost, it was real. Hey, you see what I tell you? Why is Ryo being so smug about this? Serves you right for not believing me. Look who's scared now. <laughs> who said I was scared? I just tripped, that's all. Ah, whatever. Ryo, that's enough. Minoru's genuinely upset right now. And we didn't make fun of you in this timeline. Yeah, you're right. Just be mean to pick on a scared little kid like that. You... Damn it. You're gonna regret saying that. Minoru, that's enough out of you too. Let's focus on solving the problem, since this could be important. We should get everyone together and talk things out. Good idea. Everyone together to talk this out. <laughs> Not so funny when the shoe's on the other foot, huh? So once... Oh. 
So the shrine is here. Hey, is that... Oh, it's gone. That boy looked a lot like the companions of the four sovereign monsters we've met. Come to think of it, you could call all those people we met at the shrine. Ghosts. That must have been Zuquiamon's human companion. Zuquiamon? You mean the last of the sovereign monsters? Yeah! Spirit of Zuquiamon's partner. Could he be the ghost we've been seeing? Why would he leave the shrine? How does Agumon know that? Okay, everyone's here. So, Takuma, is there really a ghost out there? There is. I saw it myself after I split up with Minoru and the others. So it's totally real? You've got to be kidding me, Takuma. You sure you weren't just seeing things? No, I know what I saw. It was one of the companions of the Sovereign Monsters. Wait, you mean those people in the shrines who talk like they're really old? Yes, that makes sense. After all, they were basically ghosts too. Exactly. And I think Ryo, Saki, and Minoru all saw the same boy I did. Oh man, I can't believe he scared us all like that. But he's not so scary now. Uh, I don't know. The ghost is the ghost. And isn't it weird that he's left the shrine? That's been bothering me too. I think maybe he's trying to tell us something. I bet it's... I'll tell them we should track him down to find the shrine. He's probably trying to lead us there. This could be our lucky break to find the shrine. Uh, he, yeah, I guess. He said, Takuma, the sooner we find that last sovereign monster, the better. So whether this kid is a ghost or not, we should gotta track him down and make him talk. Kaito, don't be such a brute. You gotta be nice to ghosts too, you know. Sounds like we'd better put our dinner plans on hold. Hmm. Are you sure I can't keep getting ready? Come on, no complaining. So I'll be over faster if everyone helps out. <laughs> Good point. Let's get this over with. Otherwise, I couldn't enjoy my meal anyway. Alright, let's go. Everyone can see Ryo's legs are shaking, but nobody's giving him a hard time. Now we just need. Oh. I have option? Interesting. I guess what? I just have to keep looking around. Checking the bathroom for ghosts at night is pretty scary. Is, is that blood? I don't know. Want me to touch it and find out? No, you better not. It's safer not to touch something if you don't know what it is. Eek! Takama, what's wrong? I, I saw a face. Not that boy's either. It was, it was someone else's. I don't see anything. It's too dark. Did I see my own face? Can he just show me random people's faces? Just some noise. Why does everything have to be so scary? Wait, why is this door closed? Is someone in there? Okay, I'm just gonna break it. I I hear something. He's asking for help. We should go save him. Is it that boy asking for help? And if it is, should we really get involved? <laughs> just too creepy. Maybe we better not respond. Agumon, wait. This is a. This could be a trap. Our trap! Yeah, like he's trying to draw us out and then drag us down to hell. Huh? What's hell? Never mind that, just keep your distance. I panicked so that all was all I could think of, but I feel like we should stay away. Alright, well that was much more eventful than I suspected. Eek! Ah, that was scary. Oh, enough of all these weird noises already. What the? 
No, please, just stop. This is too much. Huh. Enough of that. Pipe down already. I, I don't believe it. Renamon just yelled at the ghost. And it worked. What's this? Was was there someone here just now? That's weird. I don't see anyone, but I feel like we're being watched. Huh. They're still here. They're not as hard to sense as before. What does that mean? Are we getting closer? I'm not sure. It's just easier to sense them now, however. Yes, I'm not picking up any ill will. Scary piano? Ah! The piano is playing by itself. There's no melody, just random sounds. Listening to it sets me on edge. Alright. Oh, I guess I can talk to you guys. Oh, Takuma, there doesn't seem to be any ghosts here. <laughs> hey, no need to be so scared. I don't think the boy from the shrine wants to hurt us. I, I know that, but... Being in an old school alone at night is scary enough without a ghost. This is creepy. But besides, it's not like I doubt you. But you never know, it could be an angry ghost. I guess I can see where they're coming from. I'd be scared too if it weren't for Agumon. Listen, why don't we all look around together? Wouldn't that be safer? It would be much less efficient. Splitting up as much as we can saves time. Oh, I know that, but... Hang in there, Saki. You've g got me, don't you? They both seem pretty scared. I should try and think of some way to cheer them up. Scare them! I'll talk to Renamon, interestingly enough. Listen, Renamon. What? Don't tell me you think I'm scared. No, it's not that. I know you wouldn't be. Would you mind staying with Aoi and Saki so they don't get too upset? I suppose as long as we're all searching this room, we're sticking together. I don't know if it's enough to keep them from getting scared, but I can stay here. Thanks, that will be a big help. You can leave this place to us, Takuma. You keep looking around. That's right, we've got, got this. I'm still worried about those two, but I guess I should listen to them. Alright. I trust you three will do something in here. Who do we want to see scared? Jeez, that's loud. Man, what a mess. Why throw stuff around like this? Hey, if you got something to say, how about you try writing it down? Oh yeah, I hadn't thought of that. So much for that. Guess he's not gonna respond. Guess not. I thought it was a good idea though. What the fuck is this? Were, were those footsteps? Even though we were all standing still? You think that was the boy from the shrine? It was definitely a kid. Steps sounded just like Mio's used to not that long ago. Kaito, that is seriously creepy. Huh, what do you mean? What's so creepy about what I just said? Alright, use desk. Mio, you okay? I, I'm fine, I just got a little startled. I don't have to scream about it every time. Right, sorry, I'll try not to. No way is Kaito going to keep quiet next time. Hey, what's with all this wind? Yeah, this is crazy. Wasn't this windy out before? I, I'm going to get blown away! Mio, grab on! There. Oh wait, she was actually gonna get blown away. Man, this can this thing even control the weather? That's freaky. Well, that doesn't seem like a power it should have. Oh, Takuma, have you seen Sayakomon? No, I haven't. Sorry. Oh, 
here's the thing. All of a sudden, Sakamon just kind of shambled off. What do you mean, shambled off? It was like she was being drawn away by something. She couldn't hear me anymore. Then while we were looking for Sakamon, Drachmon disappeared too. Just like that? Takuma, what are we going to do if anything happens to Sakamon? I... I... I'm not worried about Drachmon, but if we get ambushed, I don't know if I can protect Miyu. Miyu's really worried about Sakamon, and I can understand Kaido's concern. Miyu's feeling... A happy Miyu is a happy Kaito. It's okay, Miyu. I'll go find Sakamon. You... you mean it? I do. So you just wait here with Kaito. Okay, I will. Thanks, Takuma. I'll keep an eye out for Dragmon, too. Thanks. Seriously, though, your main focus should be Sakamon. Alright. Uh, let's see what the professor is up to. Alright, these trolleys. Are you alright? Yeah, I'm okay. Glad to hear it. Things get this violent, I'd better take care more care of myself. Only I wonder what such actions are meant to achieve. Yikes! Oh no, it broke open. How terribly wasteful. We need that food. How can you be so calm? Hmm. Seems if we can't communicate, it's no use reprimanding this ghost. So that was supposed to be a reprimand? No, he said it's no use. What was that? Hmm, couldn't be strings or magnets. Psych electricity? To make something float. He's seriously looking for an explanation. I never tell him this, but that's freaky. Alright, and the dishes. What's the sound? It sounds like someone's moaning. Yes, it could just be an echo, but it's hard to say for sure. Sadly, we can't spare the salt to drive off the spirit, so we'll just have to leave it. He says that so casually. Funny, in its own way, that's actually kind of reassuring. Alright, Professor, what do you got for us? Hello there, Takuma. The ghost doesn't seem to be anywhere around here. Professor, are you not afraid of ghosts because you're an adult? What? Oh no, I'm sure if one suddenly appeared in front of me, I'd be quite scared. I have a feeling the ghost you'd seen was the companion of the Sovereign Monster. Oh, you did, huh? I should have known. Yet his being here, outside the shrine, must have some significance. I was thinking the same thing. What do you think he's trying to do? That's a good question. Why don't you think it through a little more yourself? Uh, okay. Why would he be doing this? It must have something to do with the Sovereign Monsters. You can think of a few different things, but it depends on if he's a friend or a foe. This could be his trial. Why would he reveal himself? To help us? To learn about us? I mean, it's one of these two. He's not going to learn about us by revealing himself. To try to help us somehow? Interesting. So you believe the last sovereign monster is committing to helping us? Well, I hope he is. <laughs> Perhaps that's too optimistic. Or to put it a bit less charitably naive. Yeah, I know. Were this the first of them, that might make sense, but we've been tested three times now. Yet while we may posit various explanations, I don't believe we can say for sure. So the professor doesn't know either. Haha, <laughs> did I disappoint you? I'm afraid such speculation can only serve as a thought experiment, a mental exercise. To learn more, we must find a way, some way to communicate. Yeah, I know. The problem is we don't even know where to start. Oh, do I get to do all of them? That's exciting. Eek! Are, are you alright? Yeah, I think so. I just wish I knew what why this was happening. To get our attention or something else? Well, I don't know what just happened either, so... Ugh, it's the ghost! It's haunting us! just moved all by itself. Exactly what you'd expect from a ghost. 
Only it's not like we can talk to it. How are we supposed to communicate? I wish I knew. Ah, wh what was that? It came from that locker. Could the ghost be inside? I don't sense anything. But all this paranormal activity has to be him, right? If only we could communicate. And last one. Whoa! Oh, it must have been the ghost again. Why does he keep doing this stuff? You think it'd get less scary as they go. Hello, Takuma. We haven't had any luck here. Oh, wait, there might still be places we haven't checked. Let's not move on yet. And that, as you can see, is why we've stuck around. Shuji's probably got his hands full with Ryo. Maybe if I say something, it'll help. Gotta be thorough. You're right, Ryo. You've gotta be thorough. Right? It's important. It's just, I've just gotta keep looking around here. <laughs> yeah, okay. I'll stay here until you calm down, Ryo. Good, good. I'm, I'm totally calm, but I'm glad you're sticking around. Alright, I'll leave this place to you two. Sounds good. And don't forget, I'll deal with Ryo. Ah, uh, Shuji, where's Lotman? Hmm? Oh, oh yeah. I don't see him. Maybe he went to check somewhere else. Come on. You're there, right? Come here, would you? I bet you're scared. Goo! Moo goo! Those aren't the right sounds. Hm. I'm worried about Lotman, but I'd hate to leave Ryo here alone. Hey, I'll keep an eye out for him while I'm looking around. You will? That'd be a huge help. Thanks. Maybe all the Digimon are pranking us. Man, all this weird stuff keeps happening. There's no sign of that boy anywhere. What should we do, Agumon? Agumon? Wait, Agumon, where are you going? What's gotten into you? Agumon, where are you taking me? Can we to head into the hall? It's probably that thing that the others said. Agumon, come on, wait up. What could have happened to Agumon? What ghostly thing could have happened to Agumon? in the forward door. Oh, come on, wait, hold on. Could you at least turn around? Is this all that's gonna happen in the corner? Where are you going? That leads to the gym. Oh, come on, huh? What are you doing here? What's going on? They all seem upset. Wait, you're all on your own? Minora, where's Falcomon? That's what I'd like to know. Everyone else too, right? I thought for sure you'd be with Agumon, Takuma. So Agumon's gone too. Wait, Haru, how are you okay? Oh, this is the worst. Why did it have to be this way? I don't get it. What's going on? Everyone's partners started acting strange, like Agumon, and then... And then they came in here and disappeared. We all followed our partners in here. But there's no sign of them. We're the only ones here. What? No. So this is where you all went. Wait, what brings you two here? We saw you running after Agumon, so we followed you. What happened to Agumon, Takuma? He was acting like Saakumon before she disappeared. I'm not sure, I don't know what's going on. I think we just fell into a trap. What? What's that sound? It, it hurts. Feels like I'm being shaken from the inside. It's too much. I can't stay on my feet. The shaking feels like it's directly beneath us. Is it coming from underground? <laughs> you mean like an earthquake? No, I sense traces of the sovereign monster's power. 
The shrine entrance must be nearby. But we've already searched everywhere. Where's left to look? Well, if this is due to the power of a Kamanogami, we should be able to find out. You can use that device of yours, Takuma. Oh, right. My camera? I should try investigating. Hmm. Suspicious. There, I'm picking up a strange noise. So now we just need to look around there? No problem. I'll help too. Everyone, start searching. Takuma, you give us directions. On it. Let's see what we find. I found it. There's a weak spot on the floor. So there's something underneath here. Why not see for yourself? Here, let's tear up the floor. This floor? Are you serious? It's so old and rotten it should be easy. Here goes nothing. One, two, three. Blinding light. Huh, and we were down there before. There, see? No problem. A deep dark hole lined with stones is right now open before us, leading down out of sight. What is this? Some sort of well? Are we all descending? Appears to be an old well. Oh, hey, this is like that movie where after you watch a video, you die seven days later. That is a great reference. Minoru, cut it out. I can't handle any of that horror stuff. But, but, it's just the well, right? It's not a c cursed or anything, is it? It's empty. The well is dry, only there's something stuck to the bottom. Looks like a talisman? Yes, appears to be some sort of seal. You, you ain't the kind they put on haunted rooms in old inns? Sounds bad. Yeah, maybe we shouldn't mess with this. I kind of want to take one of those things. Hey, stop it. I'm pretty sure those are the real deal. Can't can we just get out of here? This is definitely where that groaning sound is coming from. I'm really curious, but between the spooky atmosphere and those seals, I don't know. I don't want to go down there, but we've been everywhere else. That well is our only lead right now. Maybe we should go down and check it out? Alright. We're going to check it out, but we are going to do that in the next episode. So thank you guys so much for watching this episode. Be sure to come back next time where we'll check out this well, I assume. It'd be weird if we dug it up and didn't check it out. So as always, I will see you in the next episode. Bye-bye!